We're used to counting down anymore. We're good. As long as we're in the frame. No. Are you ready? <laughs> yeah. Two. One. Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to the Drink Tank. I'm Greg, this is Q. Today, we are doing the Mountain Dew Game Fuel Lemonade Flavor. It's actually Dew with a Blast of Lemonade Flavor. I don't really know that the thought of a blast of lemonade flavor in my mouth sounds all that great, but you know, we're going to try it. The other game fuel I really liked. In fact, I gave it my highest rating ever. It was, it's not the best Mountain Dew, though. I think you oversold it a little bit. Believe it or not, this one was a lot harder to find. It looks like lemonade. Actually, I went to four stores before I found this at a Harps. Harps? Kroger didn't have it. A Walmart neighborhood market didn't have it. Walmart Supercenter didn't have it. Nobody had it. That is really a lot better than I thought it would be. I don't know why I doubted this. I really thought it would be like... I thought it would be pretty awful, to tell you the truth. Basically, all it tastes, it tastes like a carbonated lemonade. That's about it. That's all it tastes lemonade. like somebody made lemonade and then poured some Mountain Dew in it. Would that be accurate? That would be accurate. Which is never a bad thing. I wouldn't think. And it has caffeine, so it can't go wrong there. Yeah, a guy on the couch <clears throat> pointed out uh, the last time we did the last video that there's actually higher caffeine in the game uh, fuel than there is in regular um, regular Mountain Dew. There we go. There's got to be. It's, it's game fuel. Uh, this is... The caffeine content on this is 74 milligrams, and normally a Mountain Dew is 53, so... How much is a Monster? 80? 120? 150 to 180. Wow. Some, some up to 240. That's a lot. Is there, like, a legal limit to how much caffeine they can put in something? I'm sure there is, but not that I'm aware of. Yeah. <laughs> what do you give this? Um, give it a B. You know, it's like, it's good, but it's not good enough to get an A. Yeah, it's a solid B. Like, yeah. Like... I would drink this anytime. I liked the other game fuel much. The citrus cherry yeah. was just the best ever, but yeah, yeah. Yeah, solid B. I don't know where this ranks in the pantheon of Mountain Dew. Like the other one I was saying, oh, it's the best ever. Not true. But solid. I like it. Like maybe if I had a couple more, I would learn to like it a lot. But there's really not much description you can give it. It's lemonade with a Mountain Dew poured in it. It's decent. Decent. <laughs> Question of the day. If Wolverine was to fight the Terminator circa Terminator 2, the Schwarzenegger badass version, Yeah. who would win? Wolverine. Why? Because Wolverine, like, regenerates. Like, if he gets shot, heals back up and almost instantly. He just ripped Terminator's head off. But or the melt him. But the Terminator would still have consciousness if he ripped his head off. It could control his body to install his head back into place and or any limbs. Well, if he melted him, then, then what could Fancy Pants Terminator do? Well, now you're opening it up to Wolverine and the Terminator are fighting somewhere that he can be melted. What if they're fighting in a vacuum or in the desert? Just them, hand-to-hand -hand combat. Uh, Wolverine would still win. You got Wolverine? Yeah. Okay, I'll give you Wolverine because he's Wolverine. But, now if we take it into the realm of they can use anything at their disposal, so like Wolverine can totally use the X-Men. So Magneto? Magneto, crush him up in a ball. But the Terminator could use time travel, go back and stomp on baby Wolverine <laughs> before he gets the, the adam adamantium claws and whatnot put in his body. That's just evil. So yeah, I say time travel beats Magneto. That's, that's what I got. So in a vacuum, it goes to Wolverine. With all the tools at their disposal, I, I go Terminator. One of each. Tell us what you think in the comments below. Tell us if you think he's on crack. Until next time, thanks for watching. Why would I be on crack?